welcome to <laughs> Southern Sassy. We are going to make some soap today. And, and play with chickens. <laughs> We're going to play with chickens and make soap. So I don't know how this is going to go together. It's going to be fun. But I suggest you stay tuned. <laughs> Hi, I'm Southern. And I'm Sassy. Hey, cut, cut, cut. Guys, you got the wrong show. You're Eddie, you're Greg. Oh, we may not know what show we're on, but I know the best deals are at North Georgia Toyota. Come see us. My name is Alessandra. I go by Alex, and I own Honey Bunny Wax. And I am the queen of wax in America. I am from Brazil, so I bring the authentic Brazilian technique. Me and my mom, we have years of experience. I'd like to thank God for the opportunity and we heard the community. And we are excited to bring our authentic service to Dalton, Georgia. Visit us at honeybunnywax.com today. Muito obrigada. For over 30 years, North Georgia Women's Center has been proud to serve the health care needs of women in Dalton and the surrounding communities. As of October 3rd, we will be closing our current office and begin rendering care through the offices of Associates in Obstetrics and Gynecology. For more information regarding transferring your records, please call our office at 706-226-3373. We are grateful for your loyalty and trust in us over the years. It has truly been our honor to serve you. As a local business, it is important to us to bank local. The Treasury Management Team at First Bank of Dalton handles all our credit card processing needs. As a community bank, we understand the importance of supporting one another. We know Kirsty is just a phone call away and happy to stop by in person if we have any issues. We pride ourselves on delivering service you can only get from your local merchant services provider. Let us get to work for you. Nos enorgullecemos de brindar un servicio que solo puede obtener de su proveedor local de servicios comerciales. Permítenos trabajar para usted. If you are selling or buying real estate, we are here to help. Coal Banker Kennard Realty has been guiding the Dalton community home since 1974. Please contact the number one real estate company in Northwest Georgia for all your real estate needs. Well, hi everyone. I'm glad you're back. We're glad you're back, right? Yes. <laughs> Are you going to be sassy today? Oh know. gosh, I'm just so glad 2020's <laughs> over. <laughs> I am too, and we're going to have a great time. Our, our guest here today is Miss Kim's creation, Kim Carell. Yes. Thank you so much for letting us come out. It's so good to be back with you, Judy. It's yeah. so nice to meet Jane Marie. Yes, and we are going to Jane Marie's idea. Let's let's make soap. Let's do something. Well, I'm trying to think of something fun. <laughs> so, so that's that's here we are. Say so, so you came to me. Uh, definitely so, Miss Kim's creation. <laughs> you really do a lot of different things. I do. Mm -hmm. I do have my own online business where I do make uh, bath and body products, soap from scratch. But today we're going to do something a little more simple. Mm -hmm. So to get started, okay. Uh, if you're Is she calling us simple? <laughs> <laughs> I think she called us simple. Beginners, <laughs> just beginners. This I'll is, take. This is something okay. easy that anybody can do and it makes a really nice present to give okay. to someone. So I thought you guys might enjoy that yeah, yeah. and the whole process of going through, you know, making soap. So we're mm -hmm. going to make melt and pour soap today. Okay. All right. And so melt and pour soap actually. What is this? Uh, that is a cube of melt and pour soap. It comes in okay. like chunks like this. Okay. You can get it at Hobby Lobby, Michael's, any oh, art okay. supply store. Oh, yeah. Okay, gotcha. And so you can but, get So it doesn't smell like anything. It's just a big white like block, kind of like wax kind yes. of stuff. Okay. Mm -hmm. gotcha. And then we're going to create the scent and oh, the color okay. with it. Okay? okay. Okay. So this one, you've got a goat's milk base or a shea butter mm -hmm. base. Also, you can get a clear one, which is just a glycerin base that uh -huh. you can color, which is kind of gotcha. nice as well. Gotcha. Okay. And so um, you're going to cut up your cubes, each cube is about an ounce in weight and I've got some little Pyrex dishes I've put them in there um, if you want to add some things to your soaps I've got some botanicals that you can okay. use I've got okay. some uh, dried chamomile oh, cool. uh, some dried lavender buds now I what's the purpose lavender. of adding those to soap because I know chamomile I drink chamomile tea yes and yes. lavender just smells good well lavender is very soothing 
mm-hmm. and the rose is obviously a wonderful scent as well. I so love t- lavender. some people like it in their Bath and Body products, and some people do not. So it's really okay. up to you. Well, as you wear the soap down, mm-hmm. does it not get scratchy with that not stuff as it comes you're out? Not going to put a ton in there. Okay, it. no, no. It's it, kind of like exfoliate. Well, yeah, that, I, I guess, guess that's yeah. What, and it makes look it at print. you using big words. Spell it. Can you <laughs> <laughs> spell that word? Yeah, it makes it pretty. Well, yeah. I just you know yeah. I see them like at the farmers yeah. market and stuff uh-huh. downtown, and it's got stuff in them, mm-hmm. and I just wondered what the point was. Yeah. I think it's more for looks than yeah. anything. Myself. Oh, okay. Yeah. So yeah. That, that's not really the scent that it gives. Yeah, we're gonna add some. Uh, okay, so that's, oils. that's the, okay, okay. So that so would be separate some, from just, that. I brought out a selection of essential oils for you guys. I've got okay. some lavender, some rose, some coconut, some lemongrass, mm-hmm. some lemon, different things like that. So What's ylang ylang? Ylang ylang is a beautiful essential. Oh oil. boy. It's so <laughs> beautiful. Yes, smelled wonderful. <laughs> she smelled too strong. Mm. It's actually a very nice smell. You all right? Yeah, I think I, ju- I should have done the wafting thing. I shouldn't have done like straight up the nostril. Straight up. Yeah. Essential oils Sorry. Be Sorry, strong. Kim. <laughs> <laughs> I'm new uh, at this. And then some colorant mm. if you want to make your soaps a different color. Okay. So, uh, so yeah, and I've cool. got some examples of there that I made ahead of time so you can show how to package it up to give to your friends. Oh, this is just too cool. Yeah. So, so what do we do? So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go microwave this stuff. That's all you got to have is a microwave oh, and okay. some soap, and we're going to melt it down. Oh. I'm going to go do that right now. Cool. Okay. All right. Well, let's go do some microwave. Okay. okay. <laughs> Did you know skin cancer is the most common cancer in the United States with over 5 million cases diagnosed each year, yet it is one of the most preventable? Hi, I'm Courtney Johnston, the physician assistant at Dalton Plastic Surgery. Did you know we offer routine skin checks in our office? Schedule your appointment with us if you have any areas of concern or if you have not had a recent skin exam. At Dalton Plastic Surgery, we offer an array of different services to help you feel and look your very best. Give us a call today. We have known Mark for years, but always assumed switching banks would be such a lengthy and stressful process. However, during the COVID pandemic, First Bank of Dalton was there to help when we needed them. I'm glad we were here when they needed us and could show them just how easy switching to First Bank of Dalton can really be. It became clear that our business belonged with Mark and First Bank of Dalton. They go the extra mile for their customers. We're going the extra mile is one of our core essentials at First Bank of Dalton. You ready to switch? Let us go the extra mile for you. My name is Alessandra, I go by Alex, and I own Honey Bunny Wax, and I am the queen of wax. I am from Brazil, so I bring the authentic Brazilian technique. Me and my mom, we have years of experience. I'd like to thank God for the opportunity, and we heard the community, and we are excited to bring our authentic service to Dalton, Georgia. Visit us at honeybunnywax.com today. Muito obrigada. Hey, it's Eddie and Greg here for North Georgia Toyota. Are you trying to sell your car in this great market and want to know its value? Well, two clicks, 10 seconds, that easy at NorthGeorgiaToyota.com. They say we can't do that. Oh, yes, we can. Come see us. Well, we're back with you on Southern Sassy, and, and Kim uh, Kim Carell is here with us. Ms. is Kim's creations, That's right? And she has melted our soap. Yes, your melt and pour soap. Okay. Mm-hmm. And all I did was put it in the microwave, like sixty seconds, and then stir it. You know, do little bursts mm-hmm. about thirty seconds until mm-hmm. it gets completely melted. And then the next step we're going to do is to add our fragrance or our essential oil. And you've chosen what, Judy? I, I have uh, lavender. All right. So you're going to take your little pipette. And you're just going to okay. dribble about ten to twelve drops in okay. there of that. And same thing for you. What did uh, you get? You're going to do. I'm doing baby rose. You're doing rose. Okay. Oh, that sounds like a murder. Wasn't that like Rob the Cradle, <laughs> or like murder show or something? <laughs> baby rose. All right, there's eleven. Is that's, that's fine. That's okay. fine. I okay. kind of do it to smell as well. But okay. Essential oils pretty oh, okay. stronger, so you don't want to get them too powerful. Oh yeah. And that smell good. Yes, it does. All right. And so you each have like a, it's like a little silicone yeah. soap mold here so you can each make a big soap are you going to color yours uh jay marie do you want to yeah. do a little dye yeah so i want to do grab it. the red dye okay and because it's red i'd put just like a drop in there so it'll be pink for you gotcha 
And you can get soap colorants when you get the melt and pour soap as well. Uh -huh. There's a specific type of dye that you use, which is all safe. There you go. One. Uh, exactly one. Mm, that's food good. and drug safe. So they've I can count. That. So just, oh, so I'm not going to get cancer from this one. From <laughs> FD, <now. laughs> FD and C red number four. Yeah. And like I said, the molds, I have different ones. You know, you can get just the silicone molds hearts. that you bake in. I've got hearts. Yeah. I've got little See, I want to do the honeybee. That's but cute. You want us to do this big one first? Yes, I would do it. Now, first of all, let's do Aren't you going to put your stuffy oh, stuff so in there? I would put How like, much a, do we you put? know, about a tablespoon of your botanical. Now, yours you're going to have to break like, up a little bit. Okay. A tablespoon? Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. And then just, uh, it's really up to you how much you want in there. Mm -hmm. Some people even sprinkle it in the cone, uh, the silicone mold before okay. they pour their soap in yeah. there. So give it a good stir. Do you have like a mortar and pestle I can grind them up or anything? <laughs> I just use my fingers. Like okay. That. Yeah. Okay. Mm, I was just nice. trying to be fancy. Yeah. I didn't want to destroy them all. <laughs> I do have a mortar. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. You're going to add a little bit more lavender. I love okay. it. Or so. Okay. <laughs> then I'm going to pour it in here, right? Yeah, so just pour it in there. You're going to go almost to the top there. Oh, my Look gosh. That. that looks like dead bugs, Isn't Judy. It's going to be pretty here. Yeah. I was going to say. Yeah. I you have a little bit pretty. more. You I want to save some. You will. You'll have okay. some. Okay. Okay. All right. And then you're going to make your little honeybee mold. So just pour some in there. This one? Yeah. Okay. All right, honey bee milk. Yeah. How, how, how much do you put in there? To, right to the rim there. Okay. Because you want it to fill up to the top. There you go. You got any more left? Yeah. Okay, you might could do one of those little bitty baby squares too there. Yeah. Look at there. Look at that. How Isn't that great? <laughs> yeah, that's beautiful. That's all, yeah, just pour the rest in the big one there if you want. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, Jay Marie, that's, that's pretty. Okay. Yeah. You can pour a little bit more in there too. More, okay, that thicker. is pink. Mm -hmm. Oh, how pretty! I just did one drop. You saw me. I followed Look instructions. I can't help it. I want a honeybee. Okay. I think those are really pretty. They are. I the way she's honeybees. got them packaged and presented, yeah. it makes them really pretty over there. Yeah. There you go. Now you can find you do these things and you put them online, right? So okay, people so can let's buy leave these. it alone there. Yeah, Judy, these. leave it alone. <laughs> I want to mess her We got to let it sit. Don't mess up my pink you one. You can leave it alone and let it set by itself or <laughs> let it sit for a little bit and then put it in the refrigerator okay. and it will set even faster. Oh, okay. Let me show you. I Mine's got I bubbles. Made, that I made earlier. Oh, bubbles. Do I need to do thing. something with my bubble? Take this. It's alcohol, rubbing alcohol, and spritz it. Rubbing alcohol. Okay, you understand that? <laughs> no rubbing, wine. No wine involved. Alcohol. And it takes <gasps> the bubbles out. Oh, did you see that? Do this one. They, went, oh, they, they go right away. Watch. Yeah. Unless it's oh, set it up makes it too smooth. Thin. Yeah, it makes it a little smoother. Oh, I it's smell it now. Your honey bunnies. Yeah. <laughs> your honey bunny. Your honey bees. <laughs> honey bees. Cool. And it won't affect the soap. It'll be okay. fine. Yeah. I guess you. I can see mine because it's pinky. Yes. And it went away fast. That I, is because just you could see it. Isn't that great? Pretty. That is so awesome. So I made this one earlier. It's just, just going to be I alcoholic soap. Kind of tie dye mix of white and pink together. Look at that. So when it's hard, it just pops out. A tie dye mix. Isn't that cool? She's fancy. Yes, yeah, she is. Ooh, Look at that. Isn't there that pretty? Go. And I made oh. that with tuberose earlier. So oh, what, what is that? Smell that. It's a really oh, pretty oh, well, that's, that's good. That's one of the, my sets wow. that I make with my product. Yeah. Jesus. So that's there you got good. a lovely soap to package up. Like I said, I've got some little designs there for you. Oh, she's got a southern sassy and of course, soap. You know, I know y'all are going to be seeing our chickens <gasps> today. So I have, this is my new packaging for my little flower soaps that I made. Oh, so. my God. Yeah. That's hey, clever. I didn't know we had a Southern Sassy I made a Southern Sassy a tag for you. Well, ask cute? for the Southern Sassy if you want something really, <laughs> really, really neat, right? Yeah, with <laughs> alcohol. <laughs> See how quick that was and how simple yes. that is to do. So that is really it. a so great way, like idea. Said, to get you started. And yeah. if you want to pursue making soap from scratch, mm -hmm. there's lots of tutorials mm -hmm. out there for you to watch. Okay. And if you've got any left in your container. Look at that. It's setting up. You can just put it back in the microwave and wow. melt it again and use Jeez. the rest of it. So, That's yeah, good. so you don't waste any Very of it. Cool. All right, Very I guess cool. your time's up here. So yeah. we're going to have to move on and go see the chickens. <laughs> Exciting, yes. <laughs> we'll be back. <laughs> okay. <laughs>you are selling or buying real estate, we are here to help. Colwell Banker Kennard Realty has been guiding the Dalton community home since 1974. Please contact the number one real estate company in Northwest Georgia for all your real estate needs.
For over 30 years, North Georgia Women's Center has been proud to serve the health care needs of women in Dalton and the surrounding communities. As of October 3rd, we will be closing our current office and begin rendering care through the offices of Associates in Obstetrics and Gynecology. For more information regarding transferring your records, please call our office at 706 706- 226-3373. We are grateful for your loyalty and trust in us over the years. It has truly been our honor to serve you. First Bank of Dalton really came through for us when we needed them most. Laura was extremely helpful during the loan process and even helped us open up our business checking account. Most people think switching banks is a stressful process. Our goal is to show them how easy it could be. We were really surprised at how seamless it was. And I love the First Bank Connect mobile app. Laura took care of setting that up for us too. Going the extra mile for our customers is one of our core essentials at First Bank of Dalton. Ready to switch? Let us go the extra mile for you. Did you know skin cancer is the most common cancer in the United States with over 5 million cases diagnosed each year, yet it is one of the most preventable. Hi, I'm Courtney Johnston, the physician assistant at Dalton Plastic Surgery. Did you know we offer routine skin checks in our office? Schedule your appointment with us if you have any areas of concern or if you have not had a recent skin exam. At Dalton Plastic Surgery, we offer an array of different services to help you feel and look your very best. Give us a call today. Hi, I'm Southern. And I'm Sassy. Hey, cut, cut, cut. Guys, you got the wrong show. You're Eddie, you're Greg. Oh, we may not know what show we're on, but I know the best deals are at North Georgia Toyota. Come see us. Okay, well, we're back. Welcome back to the Coop Castle. Are you ready for this? We're doing chickens. <laughs> I think we're petting them, <laughs> feeding them. Yeah, she's not real sure about this, but hey. Do we have to walk them and burp them too? <laughs> Get out of here. Let's go. Here's the Kim's in here. Hello. Welcome to my Coop Castle. <laughs> all right. What oh, my gosh. Look how clean. I like all that. <laughs> I told you. It's so clean. Hello, ladies. How are we? Oh, careful. Oh my goodness. Oh, somebody's in the playpen. What? She's got her own little, um, is, that, is that the chicken diva? She's there, she's There's a timeout. story to that. Maxine is in timeout. Oh, that's Maxine. Uh, because <laughs> Dee Dee, Dee Dee's in the nesting box in there. Oh, Dee Dee's been uh, having some issues with her head and uh, some new feathers are coming in and it causes her to bleed a little bit and Maxine's been pecking her and making it worse. Oh. So I'm having See, to Judy, you that. shouldn't peck at people. That's right. It's mean. Right. You should go in timeout when you're mean to me. <laughs> I'm having to, uh, to, um, <laughs> So this is a little contraption I got just to separate them for a little while. Okay. So Maxine is inside there. But I have eight hens. Okay. okay. All different breeds. I've named them all after relatives. <gasps> that could um, be good and that could be bad. It could be. Yeah. yeah. My mom's is Mabel and she's the Silver Lace Wyandotte Whoa. right here. Oh, she's very pretty. Isn't she beautiful? She's and very this is pretty. Moselle. This was an aunt of mine and she's a black cochin. Oh, oh so she's almost iridescent. She she's got is. like it's kind of like a black on it. Can I touch it? Yeah, so she's like, like green stuff on her. Oh, that's what it looks how like. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I didn't feel any body. Wait. She's I just fluffy. can't feel it. I, yeah, I just keep feeling like She's Not fur, fluffy. feathers. Yeah, I want to say to fur. Introduces to uh, okay. all of them. This, so this is, is Jojo. She's okay. a whiting to green. She lays olive green eggs. Oh. Do you want to hit her? Really? Hey, Jenny, come, t come touch her. Oh, that one was so soft. Hey, darling. Jojo's very sweet. She's Hello. very, very sweet. That one, that one was like a turkey almost. She's, I know. So, she's all puffed up. They're and picking black. up my feet. That's Bonnie. <laughs> she's an Americana. She lays baby blue eggs. Oh, oh. baby blue eggs. Yes. Ooh. Yes. And then yeah. that's Minnie. She's a Rhode Island Red. I was going to say, that's what I normally think of when you think of yep. like a chicken. Yep. That looks like a regular uh, chicken chicken. Maxine is in the timeout. She's a salmon favorite. <laughs> Whoa, Judy, you done ruffled and some feathers over there. <laughs> Don't ruffle feathers. Cleopatra back there is an, also an Americana, and she lays uh, kind of a, a grayish blue egg. Too. Oh, well, well, now this yeah. is pretty fancy. I was laughing at the Coop Castle, but it's a this castle. is, this is like know, a screened in porch, and we got chairs. Yeah. A lot of people are doing backyard flowers. chickening today. You know, a lot of people are into chickens, and I, I've always been fascinated with them. I studied for about a year trying to research how to take care of them, and because I figured if you're going to take care of them, you should take care of them correctly. You well, know? why did you get chickens to start with? Well, I'm just fascinated.
fascinated with them, and I love the eggs. Okay. So it's nice to get fresh eggs every day. How many, oh, how many okay. eggs do you get a day? Right now I'm getting six to eight a day. Okay. Yeah, because oh, they're goodness. all laying now. They're a year old. I got them when they were just hatched. They shipped them to me in the uh, mail and on a plane. What, did you get them like on Amazon or something? <laughs> No, oh, like, like I mean, wait, I mean, seriously. No, McMurray's Hatchery. There's hatcheries. And you just buy them online? Buy them online. Wow. Buy chickens and online, Judy. How, yeah. how big were they? They were tiny, like little bitty. I've got pictures in the coop. So like the little chicks like you give kids, like yes. at Easter, the kids yes. want all the little chicks. Uh -huh. We they did that. They all came in a box. There were 16 of them in a <gasps> tiny little box. We got two when the kids were little because they wanted little chickens. Yeah. And oh. then they turned into these. Yes. And Don't we put them say. outside. I... And <laughs> No, we put them outside and then woke up one day and they had run off. Hi, baby. Oh, wow. Well, we told the kids. They had run off. Yeah, why or don't y'all them? Y'all want to sit down and feed them? Okay, okay, okay. okay. Feed them. Hey, you want to? You want to bring the? Do we need to bring here the stools over here? They'll come to you. They'll come. Oh, oh they will. Okay. 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 Judy, I'll give you the tall one. <laughs> Good. Okay. No, they pick us. They love to eat. I only feed them their food, not and not give them a lot of treats because all that they need is in the food. Okay. And if you give them a lot of treats, then they won't eat their food and they oh, can yeah. get sick that way. Oh, oh, the, oh, oh. they're gonna peck at your hand. Oh, my Does God. that hurt? No, does it hurt? hurt? No, I don't. Oh, ah, it just feels funny. <laughs> no, no. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, little one. Here, come on. They're doing it really hard. Oh. You're picking oh. at my hands. That's how, how they get to know you. That's how they do everything is through Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, you could be a little nicer about Ooh. it, and I might be your friend, but. <laughs> oh, she's not eating her food. She's just like doing my finger. She's like jabbing me with her or nose. Like they're they're attracted to or... my nail polish sometimes, oh, too. Oh, oh, okay. oh, 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 now this one's like. <laughs> They yeah, like they're doing they do. it. They don't like. I, apparently, don't I don't like. cook well enough. So they, they all went to Judy's house. Uh, that is just too cool. Look at that. Hey, mine's yeah. good too. Just put your hands down there, and they may see it a little more. There you go. There, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna steal. I'm gonna steal Judy's guess. <laughs> there you go. So you mine don't free range outside because I live out in the country and they would get eaten. So uh, that's why I have a big uh, run for them, so they stay in here. Oh. And I don't have any on my elbow. I mean, they are really, oh, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know that chickens have an internal body temperature of about 107 year round? Really? Why? So, that's just the way they're made. <gasps> and so in the summertime, it's more uh, harmful to them than the wintertime because you have to keep them cool. Lots of fresh water. Uh -huh. That's why this is all enclosed in here so they can stay nice and cool because they can overheat. It's bad for them. So yeah. what's a life expectancy? They, you know, some live to be five, six years old. You know, okay. depends okay. on you know, how healthy they are. They don't they don't lay eggs uh, much after three, though. Right. Yeah. Okay, okay, you're biting me. I don't know how you're doing that with a beak, but you're biting me. That, uh, she's my fave. Isn't she gorgeous? Man, she's isn't she, she's like velvet, isn't she? like a peacock. Really? Well, yeah, but, well, I was going to say, and when you think that, like, uh, those bow ties they make out of feathers, mm -hmm. yeah. that's kind of what her feathers look like on some of those fancy mm -hmm. bow ties. That's beautiful. They're beautiful. Now, the eggs, you said, are different colors. Yes. And I, I've got some eggs I'm going to give you guys oh, today, oh, so you can see the different colors. Cool. But Dee Dee is in the nesting box right now. So, so what does it we see? Yes, mean? she's right in there. Is she laying? Eggs? She's trying. We're, we're disturbing her. Uh, what does it camera. mean with... Um, that's Dee Dee. The She's different the color Polish. eggs, I wonder. They oh, this is fascinating. Is it representative they spray of something? the color on inside of them before they lay the egg. Oh, now that's just a bunch of hogwash. It's How not. do they spray inside of them? They that's just the way know. they're made up inside internally. Yeah, they just know. Mm -hmm. So each breed has, yes, a, different has a different color, color. egg. Mm -hmm. Really? Dee Dee in there is the only one that lays white eggs of all the really? ones. Really? Yeah. So how old are the, how old are they? They're a year. The okay. One that lays white eggs. Do they get larger or are they this, this is, is it? Size? They're grown now. Well, now the one in Time Out. Is yeah. Kind of pitiful. Oh, now she's all right. She's yeah. really she's annoying. She pecks all the time. Um, so well, well these are pretty good peckers too. I'm just <laughs> saying they just peck my hand. <laughs> and at night they come in here. <laughs> Uh -huh. um, he wants to see in here. Is that where they do they actually sleep oh, in their bed? Well, this is where they sleep in here. So they really get not. up on their roost at night. And this is a droppings board, so it helps to clean up easier. So I just scrape the poop off. <laughs> I know that's oh, kind of wow. gross. And then I have their baby pictures also framed in here, too. So I kind of went <laughs> overboard on the interior design of my chicken coop. I put wallpaper up and everything. So, so did you build this? My, uh, my husband and his cousin built it. Okay, yeah. and then you wallpapered it and yeah. you painted it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So how often do you come out here? Every, Every day? single day, yeah, yeah, several times a day. Really? Well, I come in the morning, let them out. 
Yeah. And then, of course, make sure they have fresh water and their food and everything. And then uh, at night, we close them up in there so they're dark uh -huh. and they can sleep all night. Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay, yeah. That, that's just and too cool. And their little feeder, they step on this. Oh, look at that. And that's how, how they, they get eat. their food. And they Usually they, their they're not treadle. doing this all the time. Oh, I'm like, because you sit out here and feed them all their food. Hands. They also give little oyster shell as a supplement. They know to eat that at night to help produce their okay. egg if they need it. And that's the water, right? That's their water. They have these little, we call them. Don't peck my water. boots. So they tap this. She's pecking my uh, boots. Tell her to stop. She sees the chickens on your boots. Oh. <laughs> See, they tap, well, they tap it and they, that's how they get their water. And it keeps the water clean for them because you want to have good, clean water for them every single day. Look at that. Good, clean, fresh water. Because, you know, if you're going to have them, you need to keep them healthy. So. Oh, that is just too cool. Um, I give them herbs occasionally, citrus, you know, some. Um, um, I don't have any more. Spinach, you know, that yeah. kind of thing. She's yeah. talking yeah. a lot. Their food. Yeah, she's talking. She's very vocal. They're very vocal, yes. <laughs> she, <laughs> well, uh, we have some. <laughs> Again, she's my favorite. That's Moselle. Moselle. See, they're all up there. I was gonna say Mabel, but it's oh, Moselle. Look, there's, there's the names: Mabel, cute. Maxine. Cute, cute, cute. Moselle. Yeah, I like yeah. Moselle. Yeah. Look at Marty that. died at four weeks, so she has oh, a little really? heart by her name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Yeah. We have Patra, me, and so how many you have? Three. Six, I have eight six? now. Honey turned out to be a rooster, and Honey got to go to a different home. Oh, <laughs> oh. I didn't want a rooster in there. <laughs> <laughs> That is just too funny. Yeah. So, so you pick these. Oh, uh, you you come and collect the eggs every morning. Come collect, collect the eggs. I don't want you make to make sure they've to got you know clean arm. the coop out. I keep it as clean as I possibly can mm -hmm. because it's not healthy for them to sleep all night with yeah you know the gases and things from their excrement. Right. So that's why I take it out. Well, how do you keep them warm, like in the cold weather? Like I said, their internal body temperature is 107 degrees, oh. and a down coat on top of that. So the winter time is really not an issue. It's what about summer, summer time? Is when you got to make sure they're cool. Oh, okay. nice cold water. You know, fresh water every day. Yeah. And uh, but in here, it's all you know in case. All shade. Yeah. I've come in here and when it's 100 degrees outside, and it's still kind of cool down here. So. So oh, they did okay last summer. Gonna eat some more. That yeah. is just amazing. I trained them <laughs> to do that. How do you train them to do that? Well, you get the treadle Take feeder that I foot. bought. Yeah. You, you open it up and leave it open for a week, and then you do a little more the second week, and then you close it the third week, so they know Could when they be. step on that, it opens up. <laughs> come here, Jamie. You just you show them one time. Show, look, look, put your feet here. I know, I know. I told you she was, they're getting to know she you. She was picking my feet while ago, picking my boots while ago. Moselle's got it going on. Was it? Hey, Judy, I'm Moselle. How are you, girl? <laughs> I like your boots, girl. <laughs> and they have pretty flowers to look at, too. So, oh, yeah. You know. And I plant herbs around because they like to eat the herbs when I start to it's uh -huh. easy to just pick them off. Now, do you it. use the herbs in your soaps and stuff, too? Sometimes. Or sometimes? sometimes. Yeah. Okay. So I plant lavender, so. Which do you that's prefer, uh, working with the chickens or making your Oh, that's a hard one because I love, they're just my pets. They're like pets to me. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. Did you want the feather? <laughs> Oh, well, all right, then. There, there you go. go. Your feather's gone. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. Well, gee, oh, it's been so much fun being here with you, Kim. I know. Maxine, I know. hopefully when you come back, Maxine will be out of timeout. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll come back yeah. and see her. Now, She's fine. She's got her own food and water in there. Uh, She's good. What is this? It's Sorry. just a little thing. They like to climb up on top of oh, stuff. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. Yeah. we got to go. So. Okay. Hey, thanks for being with us, <laughs> Kim's <laughs> Creations. Yes. You can Always. find me at MsKim.net. That's right. You'll, find, right. you'll have mm -hmm. it on the thing. You had a fun time? Yeah. I liked right. it. I liked we got to go. See you next time. <laughs> Oh my! The chicken feet. There mm. you go. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> if Dee Dee were out of timeout, no, Minnie's kind of sweet. <laughs> Did you see how they're swollen? <laughs> okay, she's good. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs>